let's play OBGYN raids your vCare products because some of y'all are using things your vulva did not sign up for. Amanda washes. Zero out of 10. Absolutely not. Your vulva is skin, not a scented candle. Fragrances and harsh surfactants equal irritation, dryness, BV flare-ups, yeast flare-ups, all of it. Yoni pearls. Zero out of 10. Please no. These are not detoxing anything because your vagina doesn't need detoxing. What they do cause? Burns, irritation, foreign body reactions, and unnecessary ER visits. Your vagina is not a tea infuser. Unprescribed boric acid. Zero out of 10. Boric acid is a medication, not something to grab off a random star front with three reviews. Unregulated versions can really cause burn and irritation. Prescribed boric acid. Eight out of 10. When used correctly with a real diagnosis, it helps with recurrent BV or yeast. It's not for everyone and it's not step one, but it can be clutch for the right patient. Vaginal probiotics. Five out of 10. There's mixed evidence. It's safe for most, helpful for some, neutral for others. Just don't rely on them as your only treatment. Apple cider vinegar. Negative 1000 out of 10. If you're putting apple cider vinegar anywhere near the vulva or vagina, we need to have a serious talk. It causes irritation, burns, disrupts your pH. It's all risk with no benefits. Scented whites. One out of 10. Only should be used for emergency external sweat cleanup, never internally, and fragrances is never your friend. I'm here to keep your vulva safe and unbothered. Drop your next product for me to rate down below.